Good morning, guys. So, um, I'm just getting, um, it's not even a matter of, like, me getting up for the day. I'm starting, um, to do, like, my tidying up type thing that I've been, you know, wanting to do for a very long time. Um, there's a show on Netflix that everybody kind of, like, got hooked on where it's this, like, little Asian woman and she, um, comes to people's houses and shows, like, helps them, like, clear up the house of, like, throwing stuff out of junk, you know, whatever, clothes, whatever it is. So, <laughs> I'm going to do that version of that today and it's going to be a separate video, um, but other than that, um, not really much is going to go on. I'm just going to take some, like, b before videos and, um, the only thing I really want to get to today is my clothes, but, um, so yeah, good morning, guys. Okay, so I've gotten a little bit sick, um, right as I was beginning to start taking everything out and everything, so I actually laid down in my parents' bed for, because their room is darker, because they're curtains, um, for probably a little over an hour, um, I was watching a video analyzing the body language of Chris Watts, which was the guy that either in August or September, he killed his, um, pregnant wife and his two daughters and, like, just completely lied to police and then got caught and it was this whole big, um, thing that I'm not going to explain the full thing now because I doubt any of you really care to hear about it, but if a uh, true crime in interests you or um, you have a interest in, um, psychology or something like that, I would definitely watch this video, um, that this guy did. This is his, his name, Derek Vince Shock, I you say it, so, um, he did a couple videos, I guess, on, on Chris Watts, and now I'm doing the second video, um, I guess talking about the interrogation and stuff like that. So that's what I'm doing while I'm trying to get through everything and I'm hoping to at least be done with this drawer and, oh, sorry, this drawer um, and my sh shirt drawer tonight and then I'll feel good about getting things done today because if I do too then we're good. So yeah, that's basically the update. Okay, so Rosie's place used to be here. We had to cover it up because we're waiting for me to do a blanket to match it. So it's nice, it's gray and like cream. But we have it covered up because um, we don't wanna like screw up the ottoman or the chair. And then we have this couch and then we have this chair. <clears throat> and my mom got it's such a pretty pattern in stark blue. My mom got, I'm still adjusting that we have lights in here, um, but she got this at, where'd you get the blanket, mom? What? The blanket that she's on? What, uh, BJ's for $10. Oh, it was BJ's, okay. So she got it for like $10 at BJ's, and the whole point of putting these things up is to make sure Rosie stays off the furniture and she knows she's not allowed up here. And she, she's pissed at me, but she is not allowed. And then what she does too is sometimes she'll jump up here because my entryway's right here and she'll, um, she'll jump up to greet her, right? <laughs> and then sometimes in the morning, her spot now is in the cushion and she'll pot it in the um, so she can see outside in the morning. Such a lazy cat. Alright, so <coughs> I'm going to close out like the vlog, whatever this was today, story time vlog, um, by saying that while I was looking through things, I found, um, it's folded the wrong way, I found, um, our first anniversary, um, I kept the 
the paper he gave me in the card and he I speak Spanish and I understand Spanish but it's more like I understand the concepts of what's going on not necessarily um, you know like little details I don't remember and stuff like that but I could I could translate this roughly in my head so I knew what it meant when I was reading it but I just went into translate and in Spanish it's uh, nunca vas a vivir un día que yo no estaré a tu lado. Um, nunca vas a estar solo porque yo siempre estoy en tu corazón. Uh, tú eres mi alma y todo más. Sorry, I couldn't really say, see it too well. Te amo, Adrian. Blah, blah, blah. Um, so, I just typed it all into Google Translate because I'm thinking about maybe doing some sort of a gift for him involving that particular caption that he put on. It says, so direct translate is, you will never live a day that I'll never be by your side. You'll, you will be, you'll, you'll never be alone because I am always in your heart. You are my soul and everything else. So I thought that was really sweet. And that's almost four years ago, or three years ago since that happened, so that's crazy. Um, yeah, so I'm going to halt right now on the cleanup, and we'll resume tomorrow and do at least shirts tomorrow, so. Stuff like on the floor so I could just get into bed. Yeah, the huge. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Sad story time, I know, but I really hope that you guys, um, I'm hoping you guys are at least sending positive vibes to the families, because, in prayers, if you pray, because this was bad, um, so, thanks guys, I will talk to you later, subscribe, hit the like button, tell me what you want me to cover. And I'm down for the night, so <laughs> I'm so tired. So um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching, everybody. Mm -hmm.